Hello, welcome back. I uh, just finished getting some parts together. Uh, let's see. Our last episode, we ended up with being stuck way out here. We I think it was over here, actually. Yeah, somewhere in here. We found a treasure. Um, and then I lost my wagon down in here. Uh, after the recording, I went back and I found it. Um, it. I didn't find it like this. It still had its wheels. But when I tried to bring it through the gate, uh, for whatever reason, I put these supports here to try to make it better. I think I should have put slopes. I'll probably fix that later on. Um, but the wheels came off. So I took the rest of them off. Because this basic type of supply cart wasn't really working for what I wanted to do. And I tried experimenting with this, and it kind of works. It's got a double twist, but I think I need to go to the classic wagon setup um, where the back wheels are stationary and the front ones are uh, on a turntable. So I will get that changed at a later point, um, but... That is the plan for the next supply wagon for when I need to go out on another supply run. Uh, building information wise, I have put battlements. I finished off the palisade wall, uh, except for that section right over there. Uh, you can see the top. I've put up battlements along the sides here. I've started up the walkways um, so I can walk along here. The next step is to put uh, braziers up here. I think I say it the torch pots basically um, up along the wall side here uh, so I can see a little bit of ways from the wall um, the only side I haven't done anything really to the palisade side wall is over there I basically just completed it and extended it out into the side of the mountain um, also up here put start putting battlements on uh, my main towers here. If you have a suggestion for making this work properly, I couldn't get it to uh, be around battlement like these ones are set up like this. Um, but if you have a suggestion better than this one, I'm probably just going to put like a corner battlement here so I'm not like accidentally falling off into the floor there. But we have the start of our actual uh, towers here and that's where we're at here. The plan for today was to get the uh, farming uh, tools made to do the whole uh, um, quest for those, but I found out I actually are already able to make them. Uh, and actually I've been getting the parts needed to make these because I found out something. The plow takes 60 metal parts uh, and luckily, when I did the uh, mining trip out the other day, I did pick up a bunch of metal, um, a bunch of copper, some tin, uh, and some iron. So I was able to uh, make those metal parts. But for like the harvester and the cedar, I need a large chest. So what am I missing here? Oh, I am missing planks. I put those away earlier. I didn't think I was going to need them. There we go. Oh. There. Okay. So let's make two large chests. Make a plow. Make a harvester. The next is cedar. Alright, got a plow, simple plow can be attached to a cart or other mechanism. Does that mean I have to put wheels on it? Attached to a cart or other mechanism. I wonder if I can drag these behind it. This is the cedar. Okay. I probably need wheels. Speaking of which... Alright, so today's going to be a day of experimentation. 
try these out. Let's take a look. Plow. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. All right. Harvester cedar. Let's check out the cedar. Oh, it digs into the ground. Dang. All right. So it does look like I got to put this as part of a cart. All right. I will be back momentarily when I have a rudimentary cart. All right, we're going to try and build us a plow. Uh, there we go. Okay. All right, now the idea I'm going to actually try out today is a three wheel. Let's see if that's going to work. Uh, let's see. Right. Uh, I want the plow. Yep. Do I have it upside down? Yep, I have it upside down. Let's try that again. Why is it doing that? That's weird. All right. Um, I can't stick it there. What if I stick it over here? I made it too high. Why is it not connecting there? Do I have to have it lower? I have to lower. Great. All right. Um, all right. Let's see here. Seven. No. Ah, got it. There. Jeez. All right. I'm gonna go six and turn it. Nine. Nope, not long enough. And regular timber. There we go. All right. Now I'm making it this long because I'm actually going to try uh, that's not what I wanted. 
I'm actually going to try and put... Oh, I got five catch blocks. All right. Um, oh, I took apart part of the other one to try to get this to work. Um, I'm actually going to try and put the... Um, whatchamacallit, the cedar uh, behind the plow. That way I can get them both going at the same time. Uh, let's see. Oh. Not going to work for me, are you? There we go. All right. So we're going to go like Can I do this? I think I was messed up. Duck on. Am I going to have to start over again? No, I can do this. All right. We're going to go like that. Then we're going to put a catch block right there. And then we're going to go there, all the way down to one. And then we're going to go here. And we're going to go like that. to the sides. Okay. Put some wheels down. This is not going to look pretty. All right. But yeah, my original idea for the three wheels out the window. Uh, so, and I cannot. That is stuck. Awesome. All right. So, let's see here about putting the cedar in. There. Okay, so I can put that stuff in there. Okay, all right, cool. Awesome. And I actually, let's put six all the way, right? Oh, wait a minute. Shoot, I think I messed this up. Let's look, enable plow. Okay, that does bring it down. Okay. All right. And then we're going to go seven. Oh, wait a minute. I got to go down. There we go. Let's go up one. This is going to be an ugly machine. <laughs> Joyful. All right. Go. There we go. I think the front is going to be slightly lower than the back, but that should help with the plow. And 
six. Oh, crud. Um, that didn't work out the way I wanted to. Okay. Oh, doc on it. Okay, uh, I will be right back. All right, take two. Let's try this again. Um, hopefully I got everything connected properly. Yeah, last bit. Oh, wait, one more. There we go. I don't know what that's doing in there. All right. Whew. All right. Let's go get some seeds so we can actually get this to work. Like I said, it's a day for experimentation. Lovely. Get to see if I can actually get the farming equipment to work. Uh, do I have any... Pumpkin seeds. I got flax seeds. Do I have any pumpkins left? Hopefully I didn't eat them all. I got one pumpkin. Shoot. Um, that's a problem. <laughs> um, uh, crud. Um, shoot. I don't have any more pumpkins, do I? <laughs> if that's the truth, then I guess we're doing the flax seeds. And I will be going on a trip down south. I got plenty of berries, though. Oh, yeah, here's the treasure that we got last time. The iron crossbow, the crossbow bolts, four, three stacks of linen string, and a personal kite shield. I will definitely take that. And this thing. I heard it's very effective against the barbarians. So I'm definitely taking this. I'm definitely going to be stocking up on those. Um, as soon as we get there. Sometime in the next couple of episodes. I'm definitely going to be starting getting into the use of the clay. Because there is one. Yeah, terracotta. Oop, I started it. But yeah. Um, it gives you, it's basically a getting quests done. That's all it is. Um, I think luxury house and I just started that one. Lovely. All right. But it activates all that stuff and you can, act, it gets you better to, uh, make better houses uh, make your castle look more appealing um, and then after that I will be able at some point to access uh, master tools so like steel weapons, steel tools uh, steel crossbow that sort of thing um, and actually I think in order for me to do that stuff I need to actually go through all this Siege mechanics. Oh, I actually get to learn how to make a catapult. Awesome. All right. Uh, around palisades, path of war. Oh, making the basic weapons and things like that. I like the description. Combat. <laughs> all right. So, since it seems like I um, ate all my pumpkins, except for that one, and you need two pumpkins. Wait a minute. I thought I left one out of here. I think that's the one that's just sitting there by itself. Doc, got it. All right. Looks like we're doing the flax seeds, which, truth be told, uh, if I'm going to be just for fun making uh, the cranes and whatnot, um, it'd probably be a smart idea to get a whole field of the flax seeds going. Just to double check that I don't have any pumpkins anywhere. I 
I got one freak of pumpkin. Doggone it. Alright. Let's try this again. Or at least just try this to begin with. Do I have this too high? I really hope I don't have this too high. The reason why I have this hook thing on the front, um, I saw one person, they were demonstrating a build. Uh, I forgot the name of it. I'll see if I can find it uh, posted in the description. Um, they were, it was on the Steam Workshop, so I'll see if I can find it again. Um, they were doing their whole... Uh, supply wagons bringing logs in that sort of thing um, and it he had it set up where it was uh, uh, something like this and I'm just trying to, I, I think I'm doing it wrong let's see if this works and it's planting Yes! My ground is unlevel, and I stink at building this kind of contraption, but it works! <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh. Uh, that actually makes me happy that it actually is working. Um. I, th I thought it was going to be too high. Alright. That works. Awesome. Alright. I got that working. Uh, I actually have to clear this out and see if I could make this level. <laughs> Alright. I think I'm going to... Let's see. Well, actually, no. Let's look around here. There's actually one point that I've been working on real quick. Uh, if we go up here, I've got sort of a dining area. I'm trying to debate whether or not I should just open this up and have like a railing and then a look down area into um, the rest of the entry hall here. But the main part is actually down here. Been working a little bit off camera on this, <clears throat> and none of this is creative. I went through and I started working on this in uh, survival, so I food all that other junk, mining by hand, all that other stuff. Um, <clears throat> don't know what this is going to be just yet, but I just started hollowing out uh, the inside of the mountain and making sort of this little area here. I know at some point I probably will end up making. One of these an escape route but i don't know which one for like when i get overrun and things like that um might end up just putting a trap door over here or something that way uh they can't follow me uh let's see but yeah that's the little hidden spot that i little spot that i've been working on off camera there um Next time that we get on, uh, I will hopefully have a level field over here. Um, let's actually see if I can do this. There we go. Hopefully I'll have like a, a leveled out field here uh, for an actual farm. And I'll actually have it set up where I can just pull it, push it back and forth. Uh, and actually have some pumpkins growing as well so I can continue making the salads that I need. And, yeah. 
So, if you're liking it so far, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.